My game-changing moment occurred in um, 1996 when I was still a Berkeley student. I, um, it was a, a pivotal time in my life because I had one semester left at Berkeley. I was going to New York every Wednesday, driving four hours there, four hours back to play with Ravi Coltrane at the Zinc Bar. We were uh, sidemen on a project um, in Greece, and I didn't know he was going to be on it. And uh, I went to Greece to do this gig in Athens for a week. Uh, I was asked by a French student at Berkeley, you want to go to Athens and play for a week for like, you know, 50 bucks a night. I was like, great, yeah. I just wanted to go to Europe, you know. And, uh, and Ravi was on the gig. And uh, as Ravi's career progressed, he uh, started booking tours and needed a regular quintet and asked me to be a part of it. And with one semester left, I decided that I got what I needed at Berkeley. And I moved to New York City to play with Ravi. We rehearsed, we did the tours, I came back. And when I was living in town, I wasn't uh, hunting for gigs because I already had a gig. So I was able to go to jam sessions and say, yeah, I play with Ravi, you know, this and that. And that led to a lot of other gigs. I, I basically moved there with a gig under my belt. So it made things a lot easier.